Note, the following video depicts a specific configuration of the notebook. The same removal and replacement procedures apply to all configurations of the notebook. Before you begin, remove the bottom cover, battery, optical drive or optical drive dummy, hard disk drive assembly, or solid state drive, wireless WAN module, wireless LAN module, and top cover. Removal. Using minimal force, lift the locking bar up on the NFC board ZIF connector and disconnect the NFC board ribbon cable from the system board. Caution, use care to prevent damaging the ZIF connector and ribbon cable. Disconnect the RTC battery cable from its connector on the system board. Using minimal force, lift the locking bar up on the smart card reader board ZIF connector and disconnect the smart card reader board ribbon cable from the system board. Caution, use care to prevent damaging the ZIF connector and ribbon cable. Remove the fan cable from the routing channel on the top cover. Remove the three 3mm P1 Phillips head screws that secure the system board to the top cover. Loosen the two captive P1 Phillips head screws that secure the fan to the top cover. Lift the system board off of the alignment pins on the top cover and remove. Caution, do not lift the system board by the heat sink. To avoid damage to the system board, handle it as close to its center as possible. Replacement. Note, before installing a new system board, remove the following from the old system board and install on the new system board. Memory boards, Fan heat sink assembly. Place the system board onto the alignment pins on the top cover. Caution, to avoid damage, ensure that all cables are free from being pinched between the system board and top cover. Tighten the two captive P1 Phillips head screws that secure the fan to the top cover. Replace the three 3 mm P1 Phillips head screws that secure the system board to the top cover. Route the fan cable through the routing channel on the top cover. Insert the Smart Card Reader Board ribbon cable into the Smart Card Reader Board ZIF connector on the system board and press the locking bar down to lock the cable into place. Caution. Use care to prevent damaging the ZIF connector and ribbon cable. Connect the RTC battery cable into its connector on the system board. Insert the NFC board ribbon cable into the NFC board ZIF connector on the system board and press the locking bar down to lock the cable into place. Caution. Use care to prevent damaging the ZIF connector and ribbon cable. Important. After system board replacement, be sure to complete post-installation tasks as required that may include verifying functionality of the notebook, updating the BIOS, updating DMI and other settings.